me, volunteering is about giving from yourself. You can really change something. Which volunteering is for me is helping other people. Medical volunteering to me is a lot about giving back and helping the community. I just think of someone who facilitates the workings of a clinic or a hospital. Volunteering for me means participating in the local community. You can actually contribute to a real project or a real activity. Volunteering is a chance to enrich your own life and lives of other people. You should volunteer. You should volunteer. You should volunteer. Go for it. You should volunteer. You should volunteer. You should volunteer. You should volunteer. <laughs> Hola, bienvenidos a Montanita. My name is Amela and I'm the volunteer coordinator at Montanita Spanish School. I am here to help you have the best volunteer experience of your life. Why volunteer in Montanita? It's the total package. You will learn to speak Spanish like a local. You will make great friends here. This town has an incredible vibe. It's a world-class surf destination. And most importantly, I will be here to help you the whole way. By volunteering on one of our projects, you will definitely make a difference to the local community and at the same time, enrich your life. You will be amazed at the difference that one person just like you can make to the lives of people who really need help. I can guarantee that our projects are ethical and worthwhile and meet the real needs of the local community. We know this for sure because we work in close partnership with all our organizations. Together, we work out how to best use your skills and experiences. This is a win-win situation for all of us. So let's find out what our volunteers have to say. Nos vemos in Montanita. For me, it was really a question of being able to work with animals in a very friendly and relaxed environment. Everybody at Montanita Spanish School was really supportive. So from the moment we said we wanted to volunteer, we've had somebody with us all the way. The school makes it really, really easy. You just uh, decide the volunteer placement you want to take and it all happens from there and it's really, really simple. It's a really effective program. All you have to do is make the call and sign up. I chose to volunteer at the aquarium because I liked the idea of working with children in an after-school kids club. It gives you a leeway to be as creative as you want. El Flow Ecológico es una actividad que hacemos los niños. Tenemos como objetivo recuperar a las especies marinas, al mar contaminado y a todo el medio ambiente y el planeta. Having all the little ones like, ah, oh, so excited to see you, and you give them all loads of hugs, and just they give you so much energy. It's been really, really great to work with the staff at the aquarium. Really friendly people, very welcoming, very relaxed. It's a lot of fun. All the time when I'm here with Javier, we're talking and joking, and it integrates you much more into local life than if you were just uh, another student walking from the cabanas to the school and back. Con ellos me hice bastante amigo, precisamente. Todos los compañeros, los niños y todo, pudimos llevarnos bien con él y y lo vamos a extrañar. I don't think there's any reason that you can't volunteer if you've got you know two hands and want to help out. Then it's really easy to do that. It's a good way to practice Spanish, but also to bring something else into your day. You can do something a little bit different and unique, which might be a special experience when it's time to leave. For the people that are considering volunteering, just do it. You don't need to be skilled in anything in particular. You just need to rock up with some passion, some energy, some enthusiasm, and lots of love. It feels good to have made a difference, and it makes me feel like I want to continue to make that difference. To go from being so scared that it's like, oh God, I don't even ever want to do this, you know, to now I call this my home and I don't want to leave. One thing you can guarantee is that you're going to leave this place with a smile on your face.
been seamless, it's been easy, it's been so beneficial to everything I wanted to do here and it's been above and beyond what I expected. So I would definitely recommend it. I love it here. I think it's a fantastic country. The people are so friendly. The thing I've enjoyed most about Montenegro to Spanish school is the medical Spanish I've been learning there. I take private lessons with two different teachers every day. Both of them teach me different phrases to learn about medical Spanish, to be able to talk to the patients, all the different techniques that you need to use in the clinic or in the hospital. So it's really important to me to be able to learn that. Most of my Spanish improvement has been because I've been here. It's definitely enhanced my volunteer experience in a way that I don't think would have been possible if I hadn't been volunteering through the school. It was really helpful to have a volunteer coordinator, Amla, to help us guide our way into making this trip happen. As soon as we decided to go with Montanita to Spanish school, Amla was emailing us and guiding us through the process. She had answers for every question we had, especially about the clinic, and she's just been very, very helpful. Amla me parece una enfermera, una persona muy simpática, amable y muy comunicativa también. Si hay una coordinadora, Ella organiza, es importante la organización. Every day has been different. We rotate on the different tasks we choose in the clinic. So you get to see a lot of different things. Do it by hand right there, uh, which is fascinating because mostly what we do back home is you know, through machines. So that's what I was hoping to come here to see, is that a different way of practicing medicine, but achieving the same results. I can definitely feel that we are helping this community. I feel like the patients come here and they really need help and they just really want to just see a doctor and get some help. So as a medical volunteer, we're the first ones to see them because we're the first ones to you know, get their weight, take their blood pressure, and we can talk to them a little bit. I, I do feel like I've been a part of the medical team here. Um, the staff here and um, the doctors and the lab technicians are incredibly welcoming. To the new volunteers, if you're considering it, you should do it. You know, it's scary, and especially when you don't know any Spanish. And I remember the first day, I almost didn't come because I was so nervous. But every time you think, oh, should I? Do it. Take your nerves and leave them at the door because it's a great experience and it's worth it. I enjoy at Montañita Spanish School are simply the people, the staff as well as teachers. All of them together are more than friendly and more than helpful and all together create a very nice atmosphere for all students. I try to help teacher with daily routine and with preparing all didactic materials for the activities. My Spanish has been improved by doing volunteering. At this case, you can combine uh, intensive language training and also doing something helpful and useful and help others. So it's very nice when you can learn Spanish and then immediately you can practice it. Children here in Ecuador are a little bit different from children in Europe because they appreciate every single contact, every single attention. Everyone can volunteer. What is really important is to have a good will to help, to have an open heart, an open mind. You can then have lots of fun and you can be fully satisfied. I chose to go to the primary school here in Montanita since I work as a teacher in Sweden and for me it's interesting to see how they work here. El deseo de tener voluntarios aquí en la institución es básicamente para que los chicos tengan la oportunidad de poder compartir con personas del extranjero, puedan aprender el idioma y lo puedan practicar también. 
Having the opportunity to do volunteering at the same time as studying at Montanita Spanish School has been very good for me because I wanted to do both things and uh, usually the normal volunteering organization they don't do that. El tener a los voluntarios aquí desarrolla la personalidad de los chicos, que es importantísimo. It's been lots of fun. They are um, very happy and they're running around and they're screaming and they're but they're funny. Every time you explain something and you feel like oh they really they really get it and they're so thankful when you see them when you go around to every kid and just give them some attention. That's wonderful. I think that we can make a big difference to the local community since Montañita is a village where, where a lot of tourists come. These students they will really need English to work. La relación con el Spanish School es muy buena. El buen corazón de quienes están en la escuela y quienes vienen a hacer el voluntariado aquí nos ayudan 100%. The staff here, they're very kind, they, they help you. I really enjoy working as a volunteer. The kids are fantastic, they make you very happy and you feel like you really contribute. Les diría a los futuros voluntarios que vengan que primero Montañita es hermoso, fantástico. El Centro Educativo José Mejía Lequerica tiene unos niños hermosos, maravillosos, que los van a recibir con los brazos abiertos y que tengan la seguridad que una vez que vengan no se van a querer ir. You should volunteer. You should volunteer. You should volunteer. Go for it. You should volunteer. 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 <laughs>